Oh, there's no doubt about it. He can catch the football. Washington State comes out in the shotgun. Wants to throw outside. The ball is tipped. Heads up play to bat it down. Yeah, and if you can't get to the quarterback or intercept the pass, the next best thing is to get a hand up. Washington State comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Throws this one out to the left. Touchdown, Washington State. They look for the big boy on that one. And he found it with no problem. That guy is a load to bring down. And he tacks on the extra point. Just over five minutes remaining in the first quarter. And our score, Washington State, seven. Washington, nothing. the kick. Ross takes it at the 12. Time once again for this offense to come back out and start another drive. They'll take over at the 23-yard line. The Huskies line up in an eye formation. Browning hands it off. No, play fake. And it's caught. They'll bring him down. That'll be a pickup of a yard. One yard gain on the play. Second, Second and nine. nine. Ball on the 24-yard line. They line up in an eye. He drops back with a quick throw. It's deflected. They just couldn't capitalize on the bad pass. Yeah, I thought the defender had it, but he couldn't get the pick. It's third down and nine to go. Ball on their own 24. They come out in a nickel. Browning, back to pass. He steps up over the middle. Someone got a hand on it. So they go three and out after that incompletion. It's fourth down now, and we'll see the punt team. Marks back to return. Cut. Number 45 gets it off. Marks takes it to 32. King with a monster hit. They moved the ball very effectively on their last drive, which ended with a touchdown. The defense has been talking it over on the sideline, trying to make some corrections. Let's see if they can stop them this time. It's first and 10. Ball on the 31-yard line. Clark lines up in the shotgun. They'll throw on first down. He's looking. He zips it out. Found his man. Jones brings him down. Way to look it in. Nice catch. Sure was. He displayed some great hands there. Now we're looking at a first down. First and ten. Ball right around midfield. 
Ace backfield. They'll throw on first down. It falls incomplete. Good job there by the defense to get a hand on it. It was, Kirk, but when you're going out for a pass and the ball is in the air, you need to go after it and come down with it. You just can't watch the defender bat it down. Hawk is back in the gun. They keep it on the ground with a tailback. Bounces off the would-be tackler. Feeney with a takedown. They go with a run, and that'll be a gain of nine. Third down and a yard. Ball on the 40. The Cougs come out in the ace formation. Mathis comes away with a sack. Now that's some heavy pressure. It all starts with the battle up front. I don't care how good your receivers are or how explosive your running backs are. If you can't control the line of scrimmage, then it's tough to move the football. I agree, Coach. And the thing is, this quarterback can make some plays for you if you give him enough time back there to throw. Well, it looks like he's going to have to figure out how to make plays without time. Washington State ready to put this one away. He gets it away, and it's a skyrocket play. Signals for a fair catch, and they make the fair catch at the 20. So before the offense hits the field, let's take the time to let you know that our game is brought to you by EA Sports. They'll go to work at the 20-yard line. Washington comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. They'll throw on first down. Across the middle. And he's tackled. Looks to have been shaken up a bit on that play. Yeah, I don't think it's too serious, though, guys. He's a tough athlete. I think we'll see him back in this game. Excellent field position to start the drive. The defense lines up with six DBs. They'll throw on first down. Steps up in the pocket with the throw. And it's incomplete. The blitz was very effective that time. Yep, they brought the house. And it was all they could do to get the ball out of there. It's second down and 10 to go. Ball on the 19-yard line. Falk with four wide receivers. Falk on play action, and down he goes. And the blitz might have caused that sack, guys. Yeah, the offensive line couldn't adjust to them sending the added pressure, and the result was a nice play for the defensive end. You're absolutely right. Those big uglies up front didn't know who to block. Third down and what they didn't want to get in. Ball on the 26-yard line. They line up with trips to the right. Falk drops back to pass. Looks. Throws it to the outside. Touchdown, Washington State. The wideout made a great catch for the score. Actually, I'm even more impressed with the throw. He hung in there and delivered a beautiful ball. And he hits the PAT. With about three minutes of play remaining here in the first quarter, our score, Washington State, 14. Washington, nothing. Washington State lines up for the kickoff. Number four, and Ross back ready to return. And they'll be returning this one. Ross fields it at the nine. 
This defense did a good job on the last series. They forced the offense to go three plays and out. And now they're looking to build off of that and shut them down again right here. They'll set up shot at the 25. Washington comes out with an eye formation. Browning, little toss to the right. Throws this one out to the left. He's got it! Allison brings him down. So we get to see his arm, and he gets it out there for a first down off the trick play. It's first and ten. Ball on the 36-yard line. Six DBs in the lineup. Browning drops back on first down. Throws off his back foot, and down he goes. And the pass is caught, but he goes nowhere. Yeah, nice job there by the defense to get to him and make the sure tackle before he can make any moves to break loose. Washington comes to the line, only one man in the backfield. Browning drops back, looking over the middle. Complete, brought down, and a good call that time. Yeah, and in my opinion, it's plays like this that can have a lot of success against this defense. Third and one coming up on this play. Ball on the 45-yard line. Washington lines up in a goal line set. Brown gives it up the middle. And they make the stop. He didn't get much, but he got enough for the first down. Well, that's really all they wanted there was to pick up the first down and get a fresh set of downs and continue to move the ball downfield. First and ten. This is the fifth play of this drive. Browning has four receivers lined up here. Makes a move. Here he goes. Inside the 30. To the 20. To the 10. He's all the way home. Touchdown. Great looking play by the offense as the halfback took it in for the score. Here's a play that was well designed and well executed. It can't get much better than that. Tacks on the extra point. And now we're going to take a look at the Pontiac drive summary. Washington to kick. Washington is lined up with the Kicks it off. They're ready to start another drive, hoping to duplicate the results of the last one, which ended in a touchdown. They'll, They'll get the, the ball here at the 20 yard line. First and 10. The Cougar come out in the shotgun. Across the middle, almost intercepted. He just couldn't find the handle. That poor kid looked like he was trying to catch a greased pig. The easy scooter, at least he kept the receiver from making the play. Second and 10, ball on their own 20. The coup come out of the ace formation. He jukes him, and he's tackled. They'll give him an inch or two, if that. No game on the play. It's third down and 10. Ball on the 20 yard line. Three wide outs to the right side. Back to pass. He steps up. He's looking. He throws a dart to the right. He goes up and gets it. So on third down, they pick up the first and a lot more. When that kid caught the ball, he wasn't thinking about first down. He was thinking touchdown.
First and ten. Ball on the 48. The Cougs with four receivers. Looks, rolls right, throws this one out to the right, and it's caught. And the completion nets some very little yardage. Coach, what's up with that play? I'll tell you, those defenders crashed in and got him in a hurry. No chance to get anything there. It's second down and eight to go. And this is the fifth play of the current drive. Washington State comes to the line with three wide. He drops back. Steps up in the pocket. Throws it to the outside. Got it to his receiver. Knocked out of bounds. And the quarterback got hit, but was it late? First of all, walking the passer. He'll get a 15-yard penalty against him for that late hit. They'll throw the flag every time if you take down the quarterback in that fashion. First and 10. Ball on the 16. Falk with four wide receivers. Drops back to pass. He throws a dart. Complete. He juked him out of his shoes. They'll bring him down. I like the defense that was called. They just didn't make the play on the ball. You're right. It wasn't necessarily bad defense. The offense just executed, and the result is a first down. And since we're in the red zone, let's have a look at the numbers. Brought to you by Old Spice Red Zone, when performance matters the most. The Cougars line up in a goal line formation. Falk back to throw. Looking, steps up. Wants to throw outside. He brings it down. Touchdown. And for the third time in this first half, they've managed to find the end zone through the air. When this quarterback gets in rhythm, watch out. This could be ugly. 